All right, y'all, we are going to get in the nitty gritty and talk about the net, 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 net. <laughs> So we were doing the math, talking about these, you know, appreciation and equity and, and how much our homes traditionally appreciate in Madison County. And I, I mean, before COVID, we could easily just on average kind of guesstimate for people about 3% per year. Well, that all changed in the past five years or so. And so we, we did some math on this, you know, imagine this house that I always talk about and do all the math and everything I do on this three bedroom, two bath, little rancher, 14, 1500 square feet, two car garage, city lot, new construction. So that's our subject that we're going to be imagining. And then Susan's going to do some math and you're going to realize how easy it is to make money as a, like as a homeowner. I mean, it's not easy. I mean, it is hard. You have to mow your grass. You have to do repairs, all that stuff. It's not necessarily easy, but it, it is the American dream for a reason. And Absolutely. this math is going to show you that. Okay. So let me show you the math and we can um, do, I can give you um, the math and you can post it in the comments yeah. if you want. Yes. Yeah. So let's do, let's do the math here. So let's talk about that person who bought a home in 2019. Average sales price was right at 200,000. If they sold that home with you in 2023, you were selling that house average about 275 here in Madison County. $75,000 of, of gross equity that first to start with, and then we're going to get we're going to get a little bit further down. Yes, let's get a little deeper with the math. Yeah. So let me show you this. So that home, whatever you bought it in 2019, let's mm -hmm. say the borrower put 20% down. Their payment average with taxes and insurance would be about a little over a thousand dollars a month. So in four years time, if you multiply that by 48 months, that's 48 payments, they would have paid about $50,000. So let's look back at the math again. So if you take your 275 that you sold that home for, after they paid on the home for four years, they would have owed about 148,000. Minus all everything, fees, everything, they would have netted about $118,000. That's what their check would have been for. At the but closing. At yeah. the and that closing. includes their down payment, you know, well, investment too. Well, we're going to take out the, no, that. Is, yeah, so that's then, the gross. Correct. Well, then we're going to take out their initial investment because I told you they put 20% mm -hmm. they put down. So let's that's not even count that. They would have had a check in their in their pocket for 118 minus the 40000 They still would have netted $78,000. Someone though said, hey, they still made a thousand dollar payment. Yeah. I was like, you're absolutely right, which I told you that was about $50,000. So if you do the math, it's about $28,000 profit. Pure, 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 pure. Meaning, net, net, net. Meaning they lived in the home basically for free for and, four years. Well, they got paid. And they got paid $28,000. $28, Correct. That's insane. I mean, if that doesn't make you want to buy a house, I, I can't, yeah. I can't even, I can't even, I, there's, there's no words. <laughs> <laughs> that is that I love when you do that kind of math. I mean, that is no one else does that. Yep. No one breaks it down like that. And like, even though sometimes it's even some of the things she does is above my head, but I just know that she knows so much and knows what she's talking about as I do in my, when I'm in my lane, yes. that that's, that's amazing. That mm -hmm. is truly Amer the American dream of home ownership. And that's, that's what we're always fighting for and, and serving our clients at a high level to make sure that they get into that right property, that they can Absolutely. actually change their family's life. Yeah. I mean, that's, generations. Yeah. Life-changing for sure. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. We'll see y'all next time.